Hello and welcome back. We're going to take a look and modify the Karen BJ XL. So let's get cracking. To be clear, these cars have been in the game for a heck of a long time. And they are still there to steal. So if you want one, go and steal it. But for you guys, I'm going to buy it. All the new cars are here in Southern San Andreas Super Autos. Buying the Karen BJ will set you back $27,000. Let's see what they say about the car. The modern SUV is an incredible piece of engineering. Stylish, rugged, practical, safe, but... If you're looking for something that managed to dodge every single one of these qualities, the BJX is the only choice on the market. Okay, let's hit that buy button. This SUV looks like the baby brother or sister of the Land Stalker. The rear lights, the outermost ones, are unnecessarily exposed it's not going to affect anything other than aesthetics and uh, personally I think it just looks stupid let's take her in a motor and there are only the standard modifications Here so for the magic no touch. Toys like guns or missile launchers or something so let's get to it if you're driving around Grove Street, you should be just fine.
be like driving on velvet. This will give you some more zip. shoot these out. Now we're going down to LSIA and we're going to do a speed test. We start here and we end at the red lights at the end of the runway. It took the BJ 29 seconds from start to finish. Now let's go on to some gun tests. The start point will be at the start, but the end point will be when you, the black box appears saying your personal vehicle has been destroyed. Both weapons have extended clips and I do attack from different points to try and simulate what may happen in combat. We are beginning with the Mark II Combat MG and it has incendiary rounds. It took 43 bullets to destroy the car from the Combat MG Mark II. Now let's see how the Compact Rifle handles. So it took the compact rifle, one clip and 27 bullets to blow her up. In other words, 87 bullets in total. My final recommendation is, if you want it, steal it, but only if you want it. It's a forgettable car, a take it or leave it kind of car. The speed is decent, but the acceleration is bad and the brakes are horrible so like i say take it or leave it kind of car well that's the end of this review so stay safe sleep well and i wish you a good morning a good evening or a good night based upon the location of your rotation this is vasir signing off <laughs>